time to bust out some green stuff and make some really awesome flood customs today. So I've been wanting a ton of flood customs to sell on my eBay page because I think a lot of people really want flood customs, so I figured why not make a bunch today. I started out by making a ton of broken parts on a various pieces of armor. I feel like this is really important just to make the flood customs a little bit more interesting, and it's always really fun to see what you can kind of create and make with the randomness that you get out of it. Then green stuff onto the body, you're gonna be adding those random parts right into the various pieces of green stuff. It's gonna really make everything look random and cool, and then when we hit it with a tinfoil ball, we get this really nice flood grossy texture. And you can use your X-Acto blade a little bit just to mix it up and make it look even grosser. For the head, I just added a little bit of green stuff on the bottom, and then we're gonna twist it almost like his neck has been kind of pushed, and it looks pretty crazy. More of that tinfoil ball. And then I wanted to make sure I get a little bit of green stuff on various areas, like the flood has kind of had pieces of biomass fly around, and then with a the claw. I made the claws off screen. They're just toothpicks that I kind of bent with some green stuff, and they're really simple, but they look really good. After that, we added a little bit of green stuff on top, and then that claw was complete. Now we're moving on to an honor guard. Now this honor guard is a double honor guard, so one basically ate the other one, so it's really big and kind of crazy looking. But I wanted to have one honor guard's mouth open with a bunch of these tentacles coming out, and I figured that would make it look really just nasty and gross, which is what I was going for. Then we have all these little fungal spores that are kind of growing on the back of its back. Then we go to the front here, and we're going to be adding in the tendrils that you kind of see in the game from the infection form. I made these off screen as well with a little bit of wire and green stuff, and they're really good. Now I'm just going to be adding a few more little tentacles in some areas, and this guy's really starting to come together. Moving on to paint. Citadel paint is my paint of choice. Absolutely love it. And all we're going to be doing is covering all the green stuff with a base coat of Citadel paint. Now I wanted to keep the armor as blue or whatever the base color of the armor is as possible without getting a ton of paint on it, so you need to be a little bit careful here when you're using the Citadel paint if you're using a big brush. I was making a ton of flood customs so I really didn't want to use a huge brush. And now we're moving over to a light tone wash. This light tone wash is really good for just making it seem a little bit darker and a little bit more deep with all those textures that you get from the tinfoil ball. So you just have to kind of apply this everywhere, and even if you get some on the armor, it really doesn't look that overpowering. For the tendrils, we're going to be using a nice Citadel Red. This is pretty self-explanatory, just apply it onto all the tendrils on both sides. And when you're making a ton of figures, this can definitely take a long time as a process, but it's really worth it in the end to see all your flood figures and kind of grow your army. For the alien purple, we're going to be adding that to the honor guard figures and the elite figures, and I just want to make it seem like a little bit of blood kind of leaked out when they were transforming into this giant monster. It's really kind of cool to do this, and it really makes the customs look awesome. So I made a ton of flood customs that are going to be selling on my eBay page soon. I'll have a link to that in my community page in a few days, so if you want to check those out and buy those and a few other things, then definitely feel free and I would really appreciate it. I'm going to be doing a lot more customs and probably a little bit of short stop motions here soon, so definitely let me know what you kind of want to see. If you want to see a bunch of different style customs from Reach to Halo Infinite to pretty much anything, let me know in the comments down below. Let me know what other kind of videos you would like to see as well, and I'll see you guys all in the next one. I really hope you enjoyed these customs and they were a blast to work on. Anyway, peace out. Have a great rest of your day, evening, or night.